Has the Elker real estate market crashed in December 2022? Stick around and find out. Hey, I'm Derek Jones of Jones Realty Group, broker by HP Realty, giving you your market update for the first half of December 2022. So let's dig into the numbers. Right off the bat, there was 45 new homes that hit the market for the first two weeks of December. The lowest price home was priced at $425,000. It was a probate sale in the Sheldon Passage area. Now, this particular home was a little bit deceiving because I ran the numbers on it and nearby sales recently for similar homes were at $550,000. So this one priced at four twenty-five. dollars you know, within a week, it actually did go pending with eight offers. So that kind of tells you, yes, it was a little underpriced. Uh, switching over to the highest price home, the highest price home was listed at 890000 This was over in the uh, Hop Ranch area, and this home did sit on 4.3 acres. So a lot of land for anybody that has horses or anything like that. Switching over to the pending home sales, there were 62 homes that accepted an offer and are now pending. Uh, out of those 62 homes, the average days on market was 47 days. So we've kind of been creeping up a little bit on the days on market. So homes are taking a little bit longer to get into contracts. So now we're at, you know, a month and a half. Uh, the average list price for the homes that did uh, accept an offer in our pending is 606000 So kind of as that days on market has been going up, the average list price has been slowly going down. Switching over to sellers that I guess didn't market their homes properly to begin with. Um, you know, sellers or agents, I should say. Uh, price reduction. So there was 44 homes that have did a price reduction during that, you know, two week span of December, and the average days on market for those 44 homes was 61 days. So that goes to show you, if you don't price the home properly, you're going to sit on the market longer than those that have, you know, priced it properly by about, you know, a couple weeks here. Uh, so let's get into some tips and tricks. Uh, biggest one for the sellers at this point is, you know, don't chase the market. So, you know, some people might be thinking that the market's still hot, so they want to say, hey, let me just try up here. And then you see them week after week, their home just sits, and then now they're chasing the market with price reduction after price reduction after price reduction. You know, just get ahead of it, price it aggressively from the start, and don't have to worry about continually dropping and trying to chase the market. Uh, for buyers on the flip side, uh, reach out to your lender that you're pre-approved with. Um, over the last month or so, there's been pretty you know, good drops in the interest rate. So as that rate drops, your approval amount could go higher as your DTI would decrease. So reach out to your lenders and see, you know, hey, you know, have, you know, since rates have dropped, can I get approved for more? You know, if I don't you know, if I don't want to go higher, has my payment decreased? You know, see about those couple of options there for, you know, in regards to your rates. So those are your tips and tricks and your uh, Elko real estate market update. So feel free to like and subscribe and leave a comment. And thank you very much.